Number five, it asks us to solve. We'll start by drawing the line down that middle to separate the left and the right. What we have to do here is look for some like terms. We have 7w and 8w. That does combine, giving you 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 15 w. Bring down that minus 10 on the right hand side. Bring down the equal sign. Bring down that 5. Now it becomes a two step problem. To get rid of the negative 5 on both on the right hand side, we add 10 to both sides. Negative 10 plus 10 does cancel, making the number 0. Bring down the 15 w. Bring down the 5 plus 10, which becomes w. That 15 is attached to your multiplication, so what we're going to do is we're going to divide by 15 to both sides. 15 over 15 does cancel, leaving you with the number 1, so we get w is equal to the number 1. Next, let's do question B. We'll start by separating the left side from the right hand side. Let's look for some like terms here. We have the 2 and the number negative 13. That does combine, giving us a negative 11. Bring down the plus 4x, bring down the 9 equals 2. So in this process, now it becomes a two-step problem. How do you get rid of a negative 11? Well, we're going to add 11 to both sides. This process will cancel the negative 11 and the plus 11. 9 plus 11 becomes a 20. That equals to the 4x on the right. The 4 is attached to your multiplication, so we're going to divide by 4 to both sides. 4 over 4 cancels, leaving you with just now an x. 20 divided by 4 becomes a 5. So x is equal to 5. 